Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So I've got three little parcels that have arrived today. Uh, the first one has practically already gone because, well, I'll show you in a second. So we'll have a look at those two in a moment. So let's have a look at this one. Uh, this is from my lovely friend, Chris. Um, she's uh, saying, I hope you like these Millie. So Millie is getting fan mail again. Uh, they were Seller's favourite, that used to be Chrissy's little dog. And a small gift for your mummy too, to cheer her up. Lots of big hugs to you all. So that's really lovely. Thank you ever so much, Chris. Uh, I'll put a little video in of uh, Millie taking her present. Okay, what's these? <gasps> Are these from Chris? Oh, look. Have you got some treats? Are you lucky? Are you lucky, Pop? Are you lucky, Pop? Which one would you like? Which one would you like? Do you want one of these? Hey, shall we open this one? It's a love heart. It's a little love heart. Say thank you very much. Is that nice? Oh, seeing as it's you, just one more. Hey, sat nicely. Hey, just one more. Oh, be gentle. Thank you very much. Oh, that's lovely. Say thank you, Chris. We like those. That's it then. Say bye. <laughs> Are you wanting one of them as well? It's not self-service. <laughs> Smack her. Oh, thank you. Oh, look at those teeth. Okay. <laughs> thank you, Chris. Yeah. Well, yeah, she was quite excited about it. She likes getting posts, so... <laughs> I'll show you that. And look what I got, look what I got. So it's to replace my tape measure that I lost. Um, which I did buy myself another one, but as I said, quite happy having two because I can have one upstairs and one downstairs and I'm going to put something on the end so that they don't go missing. So probably one of my uh, keychains that I've done, uh, the, I don't know what I've got, I've got a pelican, I've got a turtle, I've got a pineapple, I've got a hummingbird as well. Uh, so yes, yeah, so I'm going to put a keychain on so that they just don't disappear. Uh, I never did find my other one, I've no idea. I do think it went in the bin, but yeah. So it's a little tape measure, look at that, brilliant, but it's a different one, so it's a different one anyway, it's got a different dog on it, so I have, oops, I have my little cartoon Scotty, and I have my little Total and More True to Life Scotty, the pencil drawing one, so yay, great, all to add to my Scotty collection, I do have a large Scotty collection, what can I say, it's a bit of a habit, <laughs> So thank you, Chris. That was a lovely surprise. And uh, yes, it did cheer me up and make me smile. So thank you. Right, now then, the next one uh, is a little tiny package. So let's have a look what this is. <laughs> Heck, I've been waiting for these since about January. I honestly thought they'd got lost in the post. Um, let me just grab a tray. These are actually a set of a little, well, they're not tiny gems. They're all different types of like buttons, flat back gems, um, just different bits and pieces really to go on your projects. And I thought, oh, okay. and they're around about the one pound mark. So I think these are, uh, I just thought, oh, quite liked the look of those. And you know me, I love anything sparkly. I think it was starfish. That sold them to me. It's just a bag of mix. I think it's supposed to be a hundred gems, and um, so they were like a penny each, roughly. And I just thought, yeah, they might be quite nice. Um, just to add on, I do do a lot of special diamond paintings, and sometimes I do just want to add uh, a little bit extra onto the painting. And I just thought, well, these are just some extra little bits to add on. I've got stars, lots of green flowers. Blimey, it's supposed to be mixed, but it looks like I've got more green and red than anything i've only got one large flower there i've got a few starfish which is quite nice that's a few green ones looks like it's all mainly red and green with a little bit of yellow i've got some buttons in which is a bit of a cheat because they're not really flat back gems they're uh, buttons <laughs> but yeah i just thought oh yeah oh, that's just something to add to my little collection uh, i think we've got a little heart there have we another gem there little teeny tiny star there oops a bit static in that one that's quite nice that's like a little buckle in the shape of a heart 
There's a few of those. Quite like those as well. They're like a like a dotty uh, flower, which is a little bit like a diamond, isn't it? If you're doing the diamond painting, and these are like a larger sort of gem in the middle with like the little dots going around the edge. So I just thought just something to enhance my paintings. I do like my starfish though. I think they're quite pretty. Fortunately, yeah, I've got a few of those. Um, yeah, I'm a bit 50-50 on them as to the price that they've cost. Um, the colour mix isn't brilliant, is it? It's all mainly red and green. Well, it is all red and green because these colours are green as well, really, aren't they? But yeah, but that's okay for what they wear. Uh, it was worth a bit of fun. A large rose there, but it's not coloured on the edges, look. So if it's not coloured, it's... You're not gonna um you're going to see it from the edge. So unless it's surrounded by something, that's a bit of a cheat, only colour in the top. But anyway, so yeah, so that's another little purchase there. Just a, quite a mixed bag, as it were. <laughs> purchases today, and I've just now thrown those all over. That wasn't very clever, this was it? I would have been better off doing it from this angle here. And putting them in that way. Let me just get the rest of them. Just throw them all over. Yeah, if they won't go through the spout, just tip your tray up the other way and do it from the corner that way. And it makes life that a little bit easier. So, okay. And then finally, we have a little diamond painting. Yay! And this one is a special. I do all the normal paintings as well, but I do like my specials. And yeah, I've got the extra little bit of plastic again. Look, they don't like sending me that bit. Oh, very sassy. And let's have a look at the tiger. Lovely colours, this one. And I've got plans for this one, but I'm not going to tell you that one at the moment. So we are a 30 by 40, we're all special drill, we have the toolkit with the wax, the boat and the pen and the plastic tweezers, yes the plastic tweezers, okay let's just flatten this out a little bit, it's a nice soft canvas actually this one, but a good canvas, okay it is a partial which means that all around the edges um, all these bits that don't have any numbers or little circles on you don't put any gems on they're just left blank as the background but the tiger and some of the flowers around him and the little butterflies down here are diamond painted so look at that i just thought he was gorgeous oh his eyes aren't diamond painted either which is good because putting gems on those it could just detract from uh, the sparkliness of his eyes. Right, oh, I can see a couple of birds here, look as well. Another butterfly there and there. It's like a moonlight, isn't it? So we're like a moonlight mini waterfall bit going here with all these beautiful, I don't know if these are flowers or leaves, but they're like orangey amber color leaves with the tiger just strolling through. Must be a warm night because he's walking through the water. I know just how he feels when it's warm on a night. Put your feet in cold water. Lovely. <laughs> We've got a key code on both sides and there's 10 different gems and colours. And we do have a little thumbnail up there, but you can see what it looks like. Very grand, very regal. Oh, what am I doing? I don't need to get a tape measure out. I've got one on the desk that Chris sent me. Thank you, Chris. Look at that. You'd think it was planned. <laughs> okay, so this is a 24 centimetres that way, which is nine, just under nine and a half inches. By uh, 34 centimetres that way, which is 13 and a quarter inches. So, yeah, you do lose your five or six centimetres from around the edge. But that's a lovely picture. I love the colours. I love the orange on it as well. It's going to really make the tiger show up there, isn't it? Okay, so let's have a look at these gems. See what we've got. I suspect we're going to have lots of golds and oranges and ambers. Okay. 
Uh, oh, they have escaped already. <gasps> There's some specials as well. Okay, so we have uh, two bags of number one, which I'm presuming they're going to be the tiger, which is the two little green dots there. Yep, they are the tiger colour, this lovely ambery, orangey, goldy colour there. Lovely, definite tiger colour, that one. Okay, and we have... A nice fresh grassy green colour there, a brownie colour for highlights, we have, I think that is like a very dark grey, that's not black, that's a lighter colour and it's probably looking black actually on camera, yeah, but in uh, real life while I'm looking at it now that is a dark grey, so the tiger stripes are going to be the dark grey, so that's going to be our tiger colours, lovely. We've got a little bit of a paler green, fresh green there, just to highlight as well. That's a very sort of smoky, bluey, grey blue there. Quite a lot of grey in that one. And some sort of yellowy gold. And oh, look at that. Bright orange. That is gorgeous. Such a bright, happy colour, that one. Number eight. This is going to be the flowers. It's like a... A danger symbol should be on the tiger that shouldn't it a danger symbol uh yep that's going to be the edges look of all that and then yeah it's got oh i see so the the actual leaves are going to be outlined in the darker orange color and the insides will be the lighter orange color so they'll look quite 3d they'll really pop out won't they some lovely sparkly clears there they are really clear there's definitely no dust in that one and then some little purple flowers with an iridescent coating on can you see this so you can see that one all the others for whatever reason have decided to go the other way up oops just show you that one if you're just about yeah you can see that they're actually very similar to uh, the green ones look that are in this packet here <laughs> Just a little bit smaller and these are green rather than purple i don't know why i said that because you can see that yourselves can't you <laughs> okay just state the obvious list yay right so that's the drills for the tiger but i think it is absolutely gorgeous and so regal looking people always say that the lion is the king of the jungle but i think tigers really do have a regal air about them and a real and the king really <laughs> okay so that's our beautiful tiger we've had our little pack of mixed different shapes of gems and things there and buttons and our lovely scotty keychain that's a tape measure yay okay well i hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me if you have thumbs up is always much appreciated and if you want to come back and see more and see what i get up to next then if you press that subscribe button and the all notifications bell in the corner next to it then you'll be notified if any of my videos come up so you won't miss anything great okay thanks ever so much for stopping by and i do hope to see you all again soon bye for now <laughs>